my husband was like did you get punched in the eye? Hey guys, what's up? Welcome, welcome back. My name is Tess. Today's video is going to be a little eyeshadow tutorial on the Mario Little Glam Quad in the shade Rosy Glam. So yeah, if you guys are interested in today's video and a little tutorial moment, please don't forget to subscribe, like this video, and share it with your friends. I really, really appreciate that. Let's go ahead and jump right in. So I used this palette, I created this look. I don't know how I feel about it. I mean, they're pretty eyeshadows, but I don't know if I'm necessarily feeling this look. So I'm thinking create another look with this palette and just to see how I feel feel about it. Maybe we should do like a little graphic kind of a look. I kind of low-key feel like this brown kind of is a little weird mix. The um these two. I don't know, maybe it's just my skin tone because I'm a little pale, so I don't know how I feel about it. Anywho. The mats are very smooth. I'm just trying to kind of follow the line. Okay, so I just use some concealer to clean the lines up a little bit. I'm gonna go into some glitter primer. I enjoy the shimmer a lot. This one, I think this is super beautiful. Let me swatch it for you guys. This is like, wow. That is metallic gorgeousness. And this purple and the red, it was just like, it's smooth, but it's just not like, I don't know. I just didn't feel like it was something that's like this. Like, I kind of wish these are like this as well, but then it may be too intense for what he was going for. So I am going to amp it up with some glitter primer. I'm just going to lightly tap the glitter primer on the eyeliner. Go into, I think let's do the purple. I mean, it's pretty on the, on the um, finger. It's way better with the glitter primer for sure. Okay. I don't know if you guys can tell though, um, I feel like this is just not as like intense and punchy as I would like. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's a pretty like soft shimmer shade, but it's just not metallic. I don't know, It's everyone has a different taste, you know? But then again, it is on sale for like 15 so I guess at the price point, I am not complaining, but I, I am kind of oh so, I don't know. I just kind of feel like this could be like a little mind blowing color, but it's not giving me that. I don't know why. I don't know what I'm expecting this to be. It's very smooth. I don't know, something about this, it's just not giving me like what I was looking for, I guess. All right, I'm gonna pat it on with this shade on the center and see if that transforms this to something else. And let's hope that it does because this shade is like honestly gorgeous. Okay, I guess I'm gonna pack the um the red like a just this like red on the outer V. I don't know how I 
I feel about the combination, but I mean, I love this shade. This shade is something special. Alright, that inner corner with a little glitter primer really just gives it to me. Now, now I feel a little better, you know, before I was like, eh. I don't know, girl, I don't know. Anyways, let's finish up the lower lash line and then we'll regroup, I guess. I'm just going to this purple. I think I need to add a little bit of something in here. Maybe some bronzer? I'm just gonna dip into a little bit of KKW's classic bronze. Yeah, I need to tuck a little bit of something in here. And I'm gonna go into this brown shade. I'm gonna add a little bit of that underneath. And then I need to, I wanna go into this. So I guess this is the finished two looks. I would not say I absolutely hate this palette, but it's just not... I don't know, there's only just one shade that would probably make me want to keep this palette is this silver shade. This is so, so stunning. Like, oh, gorgeous. You know, like the purple I was most excited is the purple, but the purple is just a little lackluster. Maybe the formula is just not really my type of formula. It, it didn't give me that, oh, you're a dual chrome, that type of, I mean, it's, it's very subtle on the eyelid, but I just kind of feel like something is missing. There's nothing wrong with color story. Maybe it's just it's me, not you type of a thing. Have you guys ever tried Mario's eyeshadow? I do enjoy the mattes. The shimmers are pretty, but I just kind of wish every shade is kind of like this. I get why they're a little subtle because not everyone wants to be like a shiny disco ball with glitter particles. And that's pretty much how I feel about this little quad. If I get it for 25, I probably would think, you know, 25 for this. Slight pricey, but now it's marked down to 15. I'm kind of like, all right, it's giving me it is what it is type of a vibe. I feel like it's a me thing. It's not really, there's nothing really wrong with the quality, but I just kind of feel like, eh. It's okay. I enjoy the silver though. The silver is stunning. I feel like there's something missing. I can't quite put my finger on what's really missing. You got your transitional shade. You got a really, really gorgeous, like a metallic type of shade. These two are pretty soft. But then again, I feel like this purple, maybe it's my skin tone. But if I wear this purple alone, I kind of feel like I got punched in the eye. Yeah. I feel like the other day I tried this out for the first time and my husband was like, did you get punched in the eye? Maybe that's why. And I feel like this purple is the shade that I'm most looking forward to, but it's not really giving me much. Overall, oh, I hate to say I'm just a little let down by this. I want it to be wow, but it didn't really wow me. Not as much as the um, Rare Beauty one. This palette for 25? Like, this wow me. This is like, wow. I did not expect this to be really, really beautiful. Like, these shades just, I don't know. It's, it works. It just works together. Two shades. I'm looking at the purple. Let me swatch the purple in a ref for you. So, yeah. This is the purple from Rare Beauty. 
this is the mario purple let me build it up just to give it a fair shot so you guys can kind of see that was just one swipe for the rare beauty let me do another swipe for the mario so it builds up yeah so this is the rare beauty mario rare beauty mario i just feel like something is just not quite there i can't really tell you maybe it's the tone the color with my skin tone it's just a little i'm not feeling this palette that's all i can say i absolutely adore adore this shade right here if this shade is a single i'll definitely buy it um, i wish mario released more shades just like this this is beautiful but these two i just kind of feel like there is something a little short about it if it's your type of a color story give it a go give it a try my first time testing out mario eyeshadow formula i enjoy the mattes enjoy the silver a whole lot but the satin type of a shimmer shade is just kind of not my vibe that's all i can say but yeah thank you guys so so much for watching if you enjoyed today's video please don't forget to subscribe if you have not subscribed follow me on instagram and tiktok i love you guys i'll talk to you later